All right, good afternoon, and welcome to the last portion of the 2014 Color of Wealth Summit. Theme, shared prosperity for all, the policy imperative for closing the racial wealth gap. We are here this afternoon for a panel focused on banking for success. And the moderator of this panel is Chitra Nabat. She's a TV news anchor and correspondent, a multimedia business journalist and contributor to Thomson Reuters, HuffPost, New York Financial Press TV, radio broadcast, and other platforms. She is an on-air correspondent in live TV news broadcast, second screen, and digital platforms. Chitra is also a producer, writer, and booker for various general and business news and interview segments. Previously, Chitra worked for Deutsche Bank as Chief Administrative Officer and in the areas of global banking, regional management, and finance. Prior to that, Chitra was with CIBC and Risk Management and Ernst & Young in Advisory and Assurance. Chitra is a CPA and attended Harvard Business School, Harvard University, and Rotman School of Management, University of Toronto. Now, let me just tell you this. When I first met Chitra and I, I learned about her bio, I was like, it's rare to see a journalist that has such a substantive background. This woman can take on anybody. Welcome, Chitra. Um, I don't know who Maya was just talking about. Uh, she was talking about somebody else. I was like, is she reading all that stuff? Oh my gosh, why is she saying all that? Um, so uh, good afternoon, everyone. Happy to be here. And uh, we're just going to dive right in uh, to, this, uh, to this panel, the closing panel of the session, um, on, uh, specifically on the banking, financial inclusiveness, uh, and the financial sector. We've got uh, a, a panel uh, uh, where, um, of uh, very energetic speakers, and uh, I will have them just uh, uh, briefly introduce themselves, uh, starting with um, Bill Bynum. Hi, I'm Bill Bynum. I'm the CEO of Hope. Hope Enterprise Corporation and Hope Credit Union. We are a CDFI, Community Development Financial Institution, based in Jackson, Mississippi. Work in Louisiana, Arkansas, and Tennessee, as well as Mississippi. And I'm uh, Deidre Kasante Mohammed. I'm Senior Director of the NAACP National Economic Department. My name is Araceli Panameño. I'm the Director of Latino Affairs for the Center for Responsible Lending. We are the policy arm for self-help uh, a CDFI working at the national level, um, and we are invested in 48 states of the country and the District of Columbia um, as well. Uh, good afternoon, and my apologies that I'm a little late, but um, my name is Alejandra Castillo. I'm the National Director of the Minority Business Development Agency, the only agency in the federal government that focuses on the growth and sustainability of minority-owned firms. So I'm delighted to be here, and I'm, I'm eager to be part of this uh, conversation. Thank you. So the first thing we wanted to do is um, I think there might be certain uh, perceptions or views on really what the barriers are to uh, financial inclusiveness, to access to capital, access to credit, uh, and just and just basically um, minorities, people of color, being able to really engage with the financial system, the banking process. And what we wanted to do really was to kind of lay a foundation in terms of what the core issues are. So each of our esteemed uh, panelists will uh, set the stage from their perspective in terms of the organizations and the constituents uh, that they uh, represent. So we will go in the same order again with uh, Bill uh, kicking it off. 